Hello everyone, we are here in the new series of my um, stock updating. I call this Stock Strats Journal. So here um, I'm going to um, uh, share with you, elaborate with you the gains and hopefully not that much losses because I, here I want you to um, experience and understand how it takes to win and what are the things that I do maybe if I lose or I lost big or small in that stock. What did I uh, did wrong or on the other hand, what are the disciplines that I did for me to capitalize in this gain and why did I sell or what is my next move for that one, All right? So here. Um, my name is Kevin Otea. I'm a financial wealth planner and a stock market investor. Please do like my Facebook page, Instagram, LinkedIn, and most especially YouTube. You can watch. You are watching this one in YouTube. So please hit the subscribe down below. Right. So here, uh, my stock stretch journal, it's Dito. So Dito, I earned 23.14%. So here's the proof of that one. April 13 to April 24, I bought it at 185, sold it at around 2.28. So let's run that example. April 13. April 13. So here, I'm using a RSI and MACD right here. Here's April 13. But before that, let me just share with you that, say for instance, um, I mean, going back here where what's my basis for that one here you can see let me thicken a little bit the there you go initially this is my resistance line all right then this is my other resistance line below right you can see there it's forming a trend right. next um what is the indicator that um uh, pushes me to buy this stock is this one first of all volume all right volume let me zoom that one in volume and it break up or break out from the resistance line so that's the point where we bought that one regardless of the moving averages i'm not considering moving averages of as of this moment all right then if you watch my video, I have a video about the MACD. Histogram is also a factor of that one. Then next, it rallied up, 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 up. Then sold it um, 20. Hold on, where? When did I sell that one? 24. The 24th. 23, 24. Right here. All right, on the the last day, because okay, let me let me pull that one in April thirteen, here, thirteen to twenty eight. All right, so that's around twenty three point twelve to be exact. That that is twenty three point fourteen. Right, that's nine bars or nine days. So in just nine days, imagine if you have um. Maybe if you have 20,000 in just nine days, you already have 4,000. If you're starting, you have, you tried 1,000, you already have 200. So the purpose of that, this one is for you to appreciate that you need to learn first the skill. Then you need also to adapt to your, um, the price or the, what you call that, the allocation you're putting it into. Because sometimes psychology might affect if you already have money like 20, 30, 50,000 in uh, the amount that you are trading in. All right. So here, um, I use a trailing stop. Right? At this point, another peak. This is a bit of gap up. This is a... Um, Pick as well, a reverse. I think it's consolidating here. Let me put a line there. But it, this can be also a sign of a, uh, what do you call that? Reversal, a star. Then it rallied up again, again, another gap up. And this is a sign of reversal. I know this is a hammer. This is a hammer, candle sign of reversal. So it's quite reversing. But 
um, let me pull up my resistance line to this point and my support line at this point. This is my trailing stop. All right? So, until I came at this point and I think nothing's happening. But with this kind of stock in the long term, we can see that it can push up more. We can see a inverted um, head and shoulder pattern right here. One, two, three, four, five. So, let's hope or I'm, I'm still eyeing this stock if it will broke up or broke out from this around. What, what price is this one? Uh, around 2.35. Right, so uh, let me, uh, it's also, it's still on my watch list. So there, that's, that's only a simple way on how you can um, trade or invest in the stock. It's simply pattern in, in an uptrend, the MACD, the RSI, and the breakout from their support line. As you can see, it's consolidating. Then it broke up from the resistance line. Then uh, do trailing stop. Be patient a little. Then until it go up or um, rallied up. Then cut loss when it's going down below to your trail stop. All right. Uh, again, here, let me just promote the page. It's called, I mean, the group. It's Stock Strat Series. Um, here you are free to join. You're welcome to join, but um, I'm requiring you to attend at least a free or a paid seminar of mine for you to um, get familiar with all the jargons that we're using, we are saying here. And this is my page for you to get an actual appearance of that one. So I help people make the most of their money by investing in the stock market. It's a... Uh, when I say uh, make the most, it's either you save, you invest, you protect yourself, you earn more. What are the ways for you to do that? And this is my uh, YouTube channel. You can watch it, it down below. Right? I guess that's it. Um, I hope I can share with you more gains, more journals, more winnings. And unfortunately, of course, I, I hope also I can share with you some of the losses or the things that I did before um, a stock uh, fall down so that I can show you what are the, the points wherein I consider that is indicating that the stock will go down. All right, so please do send me a message if you have any questions about this one. And again, uh, I, I mean, that's it. Thank you for watching, everyone.